Welcome to a video tutorial from Valencia Photography Workshops and me, Stephen Power. This one is about the Japanese made rangefinder and viewing screen film camera Topcon Horseman 970. This is a quick introduction to my latest acquisition, the Topcon Horseman 970 medium format film camera. It takes a roll film back which can accommodate 120 film at either 6 by 9 centimeters or 6 by 7 centimeters. This model has a top core professional 105 millimeter lens which is equivalent to a normal or standard lens on a 35 millimeter camera and as you can see it has a bellow system attaching the front standard to the back standard. To set the camera up for shooting, the lens has to be pulled out of the body until it reaches the infinity tabs. These vary depending on the focal length of the lens and the tab has to be matched with what is called the cam which allow the rangefinder system to work properly. The cam for this camera is just below the tab and it is orange, the same color as the tabs I have set. This camera also has a ground glass viewing system very much like one you'd find on a large format 5x4 or 10x8 camera. This allows you to use movements on the front and the back part of the camera which offer control over converging verticals and increasing or decreasing the amount of sharpness in the image amongst other interesting things. One problem though with the viewing screen is that the image is upside down and reversed laterally from left to right so you do need to get used to this when looking through it. There's a lot to consider when out on a shoot with this camera. You have to remember to have the roll film back with you which has to be swapped with the viewing screen. It has to be on a tripod at all times. You will need a separate light meter and the 6x9 roll film only takes 8 shots. So you need to consider your subjects carefully and make sure that the exposure is bang on each time. That said, there is a real advantage to slowing down and considering every single step of the photographic process when using this camera. These are some of the first shots I've taken with this camera. Please subscribe to the channel and leave me a message below if you would like to hear more about using this type of camera. Bye for now.